here's a how-to video on how to change your hoses for your extend hose cylinder because we busted a hose yesterday and uh, there's a little bit of a learning curve to figure out how and where the cylinder was at inside of there so uh, what we had to do is there are two hoses right here that control for the bucket cylinder so we had to take those off and then there's a little bracket that mounts right to there to hold the hoses and you have to take that off right there and then once you do that then you come down here and uh, probably take your bucket off because that will make it easier obviously and then there's a pin that goes through here that holds on this where these pieces go through and you take that pin out there and that releases that end of the cylinder that pin right there goes through the end of the cylinder and to the other side and that's what locks the cylinder into place there and then once you do that then you just hook yourself a strap and you gotta have another machine I'm sure there's some way you can do it without a machine but I don't know how and then uh, slide off your slide off your boom and then up here on the extend hoe there'll be another place for a pin which on the super m's it's right here i'm not sure on my l if it's probably the same way then you just take a snap ring off there and slide that pin out and that releases takes the pin out of that end of the hydraulic cylinder and then your hoses for that cylinder connect right there and then they just go right up into there they're just short little hoses i'd show you them but they're not here right now but they just run from right there pretty much to right in there so they're real short little hoses and i don't know it's kind of a stupid design you think they might use a heavy duty or hose or something but i guess that's how they do it And that's pretty much it. Your hoses just connect up right there. Right there, they're two different sizes, so. It wasn't too bad, it was pretty, went pretty smooth. And lining it up shouldn't be too bad because once you get that end in there, it sits in there pretty much where it should be. It didn't really drop much inside, so. But I'm sure it'll be a little challenging getting the pin back through that end down there. But yeah, that's where your hoses are for your extend hoe, and that's how you gotta change them if they break. Quick little rundown, probably wasn't that great, but just another problem with this backhoe that I love so much. <laughs>